Do you think that you would have, and, and you, Janet, you would have turned out different had your parents been the parents that you yearn for, the parents that you talk about that they weren't? Do you think that would have changed who you became? Well, I've got no complaint about my what my mum was like. I, I was, no. a, she was, I think she was terrific, and she did a really good job under some quite difficult circumstances. Um, I, who knows what I'd be like if I... I mean, in the book, I quote um, the comedian uh, Ray Romano, who said, if I'd had one full hug from my dad, I'd be an accountant right now. <laughs> and I think, I think sometimes... And you notice in, in, in uh, comedy, uh, stand-ups especially, there seem to be... Sometimes it feels like a quarter of them are adopted. Mm. And, you know, <laughs> there is always this strange dysfunction going on when you, you see it quite often in, in... You know, I hope my girls never want to be writers because I, I hope they're, they're happier than that. I think the other thing that, that chime with me is when you go, we were talking about it again earlier, I, say, I said to the girls that when I go to school, when I went to school, I wasn't really aware that my home life was a bit weird, to put it mildly, because as someone under 10, you just don't discuss it, do you? You go to school, you keep your head down, you don't want to stand out, you, you know, I look pretty weird, so you don't say, is my mum or dad odd compared yeah. to your mum and dad. Well, that's all well, you know, anyway. exactly. Well, exactly, it's completely normal. There's nothing more normal but than... when you get to university or college or later on, when you're about 18, then you can talk, you can meet normal people yeah. and you realise that perhaps your background was a bit bizarre. Yeah, I mean, yeah, and other people put their knives and forks at a slight angle. And like, What's going on? You completely come from a different family. This is weird.